down to Mother's Day is on for Sunday. We also have Mexican Mother's Day today. Right. It's also important. Don't show up to your mom's house empty handed. Yeah, don't do that. Luckily, the California Flower Mall is already open and will be through the big day for last minute flower shopping. And joining us live is Mark Chadoff. He's the president of the California Flower Mall. So, Mark, can you show us a bit of what customers will be seeing there for Mother's Day weekend? Oh, well, my goodness, what they'll be seeing thousands and thousands of flowers. Um, uh, this is the wholesale side of California Flower Mall where you're buying basically in bulk. You can do a DIY. You can buy bundles of flowers and, and assemble your own arrangement. We do have other vendors here that also make arrangements for mom. Uh, today is Mexican Mother's Day. It is a very important day. We have been extremely busy. Uh, yesterday was epic, and today is the day. So uh, it's, it's a day to celebrate all of our moms uh, that we all have in our lives. Yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be busy and it ha probably has been all week. But out of curiosity, which flowers are some of the more popular flowers that people tend to go to, besides roses? Uh, I mean, besides roses, you have the sunflowers. You can see the sunflowers here. You have, obviously, you have uh, roses. But you also sell a lot of live plants, which seems to be another alternative that lasts a little longer. And you have a, a plethora of products here that you can buy, you know, without getting all of the names. And of course, you have, you know, uh, mums and, and lilies. And, and, and it just it's everything's here uh, in the flower district. And it's just really critical that um, it's, it's also critical to our local economy here that this, this area here survives. And, and it's our biggest day of the year. Is is Mother's Day. It's bigger than Valentine's Day for the low, for here in Los Angeles. So it's and important. Come on down and celebrate your mom. Yes, everybody loves their moms. That's why it's so popular. Okay, so Mark, you guys are having extended hours to help everyone get what they need. Can you tell us more about the special hours and when is the best time? Help our viewers. When's the best time to sneak in there, get something, and get out? <laughs> Uh, get in and get out. The best time is early in the morning. Uh, and can you come down early in the morning? We're, we're going to be open uh, till 9, 8, 9 p.m. tonight. We may extend that depending on the demand. And we're open 24 hours uh, tomorrow um, going into Mother's Day, uh, the American Mother's Day. So we have extended hours. We're open. We've been, we're open to midnight last night. So we're open in late, long hours. And I, I would suggest coming in the morning time. The afternoon is going to get very busy. Uh, Friday, it's going to be, uh, it'll be more difficult to get in, but you know, you will get in. You will save money by doing so. Uh, Saturday, uh, it might be a little less busy as far as the traffic patterns are concerned. Uh, but uh, I would suggest coming early in the morning or come in after work when, when traffic dies down. Yeah, and Mark, real fast, um, just out of curiosity, you're a flower expert. What, what's your favorite flower? <laughs> oh, my. oh gosh, my favorite flowers. You know, I'll have to stick to the uh, to the roses, uh, white roses, red roses. Uh, they're all very, very, uh, you know, important. Uh, you know, they make my house look beautiful. Uh, they're, they're. I mean, <laughs> I have lots of flowers in the house. I just take them home and and assemble them, put them together. Uh, you know, mums are nice. Uh, they're all beautiful. I mean, you're asking a, uh, you're asking. I'm, it's I'm like not saying, what, which side, one is your but, favorite uh, child? But, you just don't answer it, but you always exactly. have one. You know, he went with a classic, white roses, you can never one, right? go wrong. Yeah. Yes. Mark, thank you so much. You can never go wrong. That, that, thank you. All right, it's 540 now, guys. Go get your mom some flowers. Yes, we've got an unbelievable story that you have to see to believe. A man gets attacked by not one, but two sharks at the same time. <gasps> But he survives. Yeah, his terrifying story. It sounds horrific. And humans are humans closer to speaking to animals. See, cutting edge technology that could make that possible. And then a touching story you don't want to miss. We'll meet the mom who gave her daughter the ultimate gift a second shot at life.